What's going on guys, Krahu here, long time no speak, but you goddamn know I'm gonna give you guys my opinion on the Call of Duty World War 2 beta. First and foremost, my apologies for this not being 60 frames per second. Uh, what I actually did, the entire beta, uh, so usually I don't have my Elgato hooked up, um, you know, I record a lot less now, I still play games, but I just record a lot less. Um, so I did not use the Elgato to record any of my, you know, gameplay sessions, and yesterday I was like, shit it's the last day of the beta week one i really want to release something so i fired up the old uh trusty ps4 share last two games after game of thrones finale which was amazing uh and this was one of them i really wish i could have recorded the one where i went like 30 and 2 but that didn't record unfortunately um but this did and this was pretty awesome as well so i hope you guys enjoy if you missed me and if you enjoyed this video, please be sure to leave a like. That would be fantastic. Uh, I'm very active on Twitter as well, so if you ever want to chat, um, you can you know hit me up on Twitter. Link is in the description as well. Um, and let's get into the you know meat and potatoes of this video, which is what do I think? What do I think of Call of Duty World War II? It's different. It's different. So let's start. Let's perhaps start with the negatives, the things that I don't like about this game. Nobody seems to, you know, mention at all, and I've watched a bunch of videos, that this game is pretty fucking ugly. I know it's a beta. Maybe it's going to improve. I don't know. Uh, but at this point, it's pretty fucking ugly. Nothing screams next gen about this game whatsoever. Textures look washed up. Um, animations, you know, are recycled. Everything is recycled. Everything is here to remind you that, yes, this is a Call of Duty. Uh, Black Ops 3 looks better. Even Ghosts, to some extent, on the PS4 looks better. Uh, so it's not the prettiest thing. But looks don't matter, right? Uh, although, I'm still, I still kind of want a next-gen, proper next-gen Call of Duty game. You know what I mean? Maybe at one point I'm going to get it. Um, so that's pretty much it. You know, initially, before I... And this is a pretty awesome streak, too. Uh, the, the little stuck up dive bomber. Uh, so, you know, open... I didn't want to release, like, my super first impressions because I knew that my... You know, my vision about this game is going to be a little bit skewed because every single Call of Duty game has a learning curve to it. And I just wanted to showcase everything here. This is the speed at which care packages, you know, drop in. I was lucky enough to get... Uh, oh shit, that's a recon. I thought it was gonna be another dive bomber. God damn it. Wrong gameplay. So every Call of Duty game has its own learning curve. And, um, you know, I didn't want to play a couple of games and then tell you, this game is fucking amazing because I went like 30 and 2 or whatever. I wanted to take my time, max out the levels. I am, you know, at the level cap here, level 25. I've experimented with every single class and this turns out to be my favorite. A lot, and I mean a lot of people use the PPSH, uh, you know, submachine gun classes, and that's that's fine, whatevs. But to me, it just doesn't do the trick, and look at this shit, look at this goddamn triple spray. I wish that dude, I wish I caught that one dude to the side for the, for the quad spray, but I wasn't able to. So everything is going right, right? Like, so far, I'm on this beastly ass uh, kill streak. I'm about to get my paratroopers, which I got in the other game that didn't record that I really wanted to use. And they were actually doing some work, and look at this shit! Son! Look at this! This dude went full beast mode and completely annihilated me with the sniper rifle. And I swear on everything prior to this game, I got killed by the sniper one time. And look at this shit. Look what's happening here. I was like, I was checking the scoreboard. I'm like, am I in some sort of a quick scoping lobby? Is there something I, I'm not aware of? But I got murked like one kill before the paratroopers. And I was really looking forward to showcasing them in this gameplay. Um, but unfortunately, I wasn't able to yet, you know. Uh, <laughs> look, another one. God damn it. What is happening? Um, I mean, kudos to the first guy because he, you know, he destroyed me. That was a nasty ass uh, answer to my uh, triple spray. Uh, but prior to this gameplay, I had no problems with the fucking snipers. I got killed maybe like once, twice. And over here, it was just non-stop, man. So I don't know if the snipers. So 
from people that ran into more snipers than I have, because maybe I haven't run into a lot. What the hell is with the snipers? Are they- LOOK AT THIS SHIT, SON! Look at him! Okay, that was a hard scope, but still, you know, one shot kill. And I picked up a sniper rifle here and there, and I got like three kills, uh, no big deal. Um, you know, they were kind of- uh, One quick scope, yes, one quick scope, because I just wanted to fuck around, see how it is. And one just, you know, the rest are like a couple of hard drag scopes or whatever. Uh, so if you have any experience with this one, so everything here was just going down the hill. I was, you know, getting shed on left and right. So I was like, okay, Grau, you gotta pick this shit up, because you were going beast mode in the beginning, and now you're getting your ass kicked. No more, okay? No more. Uh, so going back, because I kind of went off tangent. So this game does definitely have a learning curve. I did not play with the headset. Headset... I have the Astro A40s, man, and it is... I can't hear these guys. I mean, okay, I can, but only when you play, like, a super slow defensive way to pick up those, uh, you know, um, footsteps here and there on occasion when you're, like, by yourself, when there's not a lot of background noise, you can hear people, but that's not my play style. This is my play style. Um, and initially, the first couple of games, yes... I was getting my ass kicked, uh, it's a new Call of Duty, I was still trying to get my footing, but then all of a sudden, like day two, everything just goddamn clicked and boom, we got scores like I used to get. Uh, the good things about this game is obviously the setting, I really enjoy these guns. These guns are very nice, uh, submachine guns, PPSH is definite king, uh, in some instances I did get outgun, outgun uh, long range <laughs> with the PPSH, so that was kind of bleh, so maybe they're gonna look into it. Uh, 75 point uh, team deathmatch is another thing I forgot to mention. I'm goddamn almost 100% sure they're gonna raise that back up to uh, to 100 because these games are just wicked fast. And I tried all the game modes. War game mode is fun. I'm going to put more hours into it in week two. I tried domination. Domination is fun as well, although it's a little bit more difficult to earn your kill streaks, which are such a big part of Call of Duty games. Um, and the kill streaks are okay. They're okay uh, for me. Paratroopers. I know a lot of people said paratroopers are kind of bleh. They're kind of like dogs. Uh, but for me, you know, the, the couple of times I used them, uh, they were okay. They did fine, especially on this map. They actually kind of wrecked people, so that was uh, that was nice. But this is a very fun kill streak as well. So kill streaks are okay. They're not super terrible. Uh, the artillery strike may be a little bit super terrible, but on something like Domination, when they're capturing a flag, it might be awesome. You just gotta get it. Uh, so you have to be careful with this game. Um, <laughs> look at this shit. I was like, no way am I stopping. And I'm using extended mags, that's why I have so much ammunition. So you just have to be, be careful. Take your time, and you're gonna get them kills. I know a lot of people are frustrated because they constantly die, and in the beginning I was one of them, and look at this shit, 74 to 75. There's a lot more that I want to say about this game. Final score was, what is that? Is that 25 and 6? 26 and 5? I think, yeah, one of those. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this gameplay. I will release more footage from Call of Duty World War 2. It's good to be back. Uh, thank you so much to those that are left. Uh, be sure to check out the description, leave a like. This was Krahu, see you guys next time.